What's going on guys, Carlos here from Live Gaming Paradise and we are back again with another Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild tutorial. This time we are doing the Shrine Quest Master of the Wind, which in turn will uncover the shrine Shai Yota, if I'm not mistaken. These shrines are uh, really difficult to remember. This is in the Lanario region which is um, northeast, sort of. You will have to look for it. There's plenty of maps online. Well, I hope you're all doing well. And without further ado, let's start the, shri the Shrine Quest for Master of the Wind. This one is a little bit tricky. There's a platform sitting in, on the rocks in the center. There's loads of wind going around it. Just go to um, Cass and it will give you the mission. And then all you need to do is go around, there should be four blockades, like uh, rocks, just like those in front of me, um, that will be blocking the path of the wind. And in order to light up the shrine and complete this quest, you will need to destroy them. So just grab your bombs, either the time bombs or remote bombs or the normal bombs will do, as long as you're not too close to the where the rocks are and uh, let's start destroying them in order to um, in to open the path for the wind so you can ride the wind literally with your glider there should be four of them so just look around there's going to be two of them inside of the main sh rock structure in the center like right there in front of me so just go in there there's going to be one inside of it and the other one is just outside to the left so go and destroy those ones. In this area here, I find that it was easier to to create a block of ice in the center. Just climb it because the 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 path you need to open is on the top instead of on the bottom. Just throw a bomb towards it and just explode the bomb as soon as it touches it, and it should be all right. It should uncover the path there. And there you go. That's the second one done. There's going to be one to your left, as you can see in the image on the bottom right. Uh, so go there next and destroy that one. I tried to do it from here. It doesn't work because the wind blows the bomb towards you. So no good. It's not going to work. So go to the other side and climb on the rock opposite. And you should be able to send the bomb or throw the bomb. And uh, you will destroy the, the rocks there so you can open the path for you. I find it easier to just sit in between the rocks and the bomb because or else you'll go too high okay so once that one is done we've got one more to do and then we will be able to ride the wind all the way to the shrine because finally when you destroy all the obstructions for the wind you're gonna have to ride the wind all around it with your glider and land exactly on that platform i had to do it twice in order to to get this done because it's quite tricky just make sure that you land on on the on the shrine base and you should be should be okay so there's going to be one more and it's further up so right where i am heading to as you can see they're in nested nested in between those two rocks so just go over there just throw a bomb on there and that should be uh, all the destruction that we're going to do so that's it all of the obstructions are out of the way now and all you need to do is ride the wing the wind so this is the a tricky part you know the i've tried it twice and the best option is to start on the right exactly where i am when you destroy the last one if you're following the same order as i did then just climb on top of that rock right next to it and just start from there that's that works so if you want this to be as easy as possible, then start from here and just use your glider and just keep following the path around. You don't need to go around that rock, although the wind goes that way. Just go before the rock and then just keep following it down in between the, the main structure in the center. And now the tricky part to land on the shrine base. Once you land on the shrine base, the shrine base will turn blue and the shrine will rise out of the ground. So this is the Shay. Yota, if I'm not mistaken. I keep forgetting these names. I'm really sorry. I'm bad with names. And when the the names are a bit um, different, 
then it, it's much harder for me. I hope you don't mind that. So let's see the name of the shrine now. I think it's Shay Yota, if I'm not mistaken. So Master of the Wind is complete now. And you've got one extra shrine to, to add to your repertoire of shrines. So Shai Yota, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. So the shrine, obviously, there's nothing to it. So I just left it in to the in, in to the end to end this video. And um, and you just need to collect whatever it's in the chest and collect your orb. And that's it. There's not much to it at all. So I hope you've been enjoying these videos. I have got a ton of them in my channel. I have been uploading loads of Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild videos and I really hope you are enjoying them. Uh, if you can, give me a thumbs up. If this helped you at all, consider subscribing. I've got loads of content coming up like this and other gameplays from different games. But I would like to finish this one and um, I would like to finish Ganon on a live stream so I have got I am planning that so it should be should be coming soon once I finish all the shrine quests in all the shrines once I uncover pretty much all the shrines in Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild well thank you very much for watching this is it for this video I'll see you all in the next one goodbye